To find the second derivative of 1 over x, we need to take the derivative of the derivative of 1 over x, so the derivative of the derivative. Then we should rewrite 1 over x as a power. Hopefully you know 1 over x is the same as x to the negative 1. Then the derivative of x to the negative 1 is found by using the power rule. Bring the power of negative 1 down in front as a factor, and then reduce the power by 1. So we have the negative in front, and then the power becomes negative 2. That's the first derivative, but we want the second derivative, which is why we still have a derivative operator here. To take the second derivative, well, we just use the power rule again. That means the power of negative 2 will come in front as a factor. There's already a negative, so the negatives will cancel out. And then we'll reduce the power by 1 once more. Thus, negative 2 times the negative gives us the positive 2 in front, and then negative 2 minus 1 gives us our new power of negative 3. And that's the second derivative of 1 over x. If you prefer to write it without negative powers, you can move the x to the denominator and hence get 2 over x cubed. Either one of these is fine. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and be sure to check out my Calc 1 course and Calc 1 exercises playlists in the description for more. Thanks for watching.